Well, well, well. Will you look what I'm coming up upon? I am in Sacramento, California, and just ahead is a Golden Gate Bridge replica, a pedestrian bridge called the Guy West Bridge. And this bridge is actually designed to look like the Golden Gate Bridge. <laughs> it's the same international orange paint color, and it was purposely designed, it's a pedestrian bridge, to look just like the actual thing in San Francisco. Now, this bridge was built in the 1960s, named after Guy West, who was the, I believe, president of University of California, Sacramento. It wouldn't be one of my videos if I didn't get one of the facts a little fuzzy. I mean, they really should have named it the Golden Gate Bridge Jr., but nonetheless, they named it after him, and it was fully designed to be a replica of the Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco. And they did a pretty good job, if I do say so myself. Now, this bridge is a pedestrian walkway, so it's much calmer than the actual Golden Gate. In fact, I've only seen a couple of people on this right now. I mean, it's a little not ideal weather today, but uh, feels like you're walking across <laughs> exactly what it is a mini version of the golden gate bridge i feel a little bit like singing everywhere you look everywhere there's a bridge there's a bridge that's a replica of the golden gate yeah I made that up just now now this bridge doesn't go over the golden gate instead it goes over the american river which you can see here it's a little bit different of a location than its inspiration all right, we are nearing towards the other side of the Guy West Bridge. Again, it's a little, little bit more to it than I thought there would be. So pretty impressive, even these little lights that look like the lights that they have at the actual thing. And we're gonna go ahead and walk back over the, the bridge itself. And you know what? Luckily there are no tolls this way. <laughs> or anyway. It's free. It's a pedestrian bridge. It's pretty cool. Look at that in the background. It's like I'm on the Golden Gate. Even with water behind me, as I mentioned. It's getting very windy. But, uh, pretty crazy. Yeah, pretty darn nifty. And pretty darn windy. But I do love roadside attractions like this. Unique things. Things you don't see every day, but I do, every day. That was a Jungle Cruise joke, but anyway, no, this was pretty cool. We're getting near where we started. One might say, right back where we started from. Should I sing again? Comment below. No, I know the answer's no, so I won't. They even have this part underneath that looks like what you would see in the actual Golden Gate span, like right at the entrance with this part here. Pretty nifty. There's actually quite a few trails around here too. Near it, I mean, there's the one that goes up to it that you can actually walk across the span, if you will. But then there's a couple of bike trails here as well that go right underneath it. And this is what it's like under the bridge. It's pretty, uh, pretty nifty. Look at that, it looks like the real shebang. All right, well, thanks for watching this video. Hopefully you found it interesting. Again, I always like roadside attractions that are usually interesting slash, sometimes I like the replicas more than the actual thing. For some reason this is pretty interesting to see and uh, as i mentioned a little less chaotic than the actual golden gate bridge but hopefully you enjoyed this video subscribe to this channel for more kind of interesting roadside attraction videos talks with friends podcast style tours of national parks hopefully disneyland in the near future now that it's back up and running but uh if you enjoyed this please go ahead and subscribe and tell your friends to subscribe and thank you for watching
I'm about to go cross the fake Golden Gate again. Talk to you next time. Bye-bye.